What is this? It's a thing. You said you wanted work. This is work. Uh-huh. And who's the guy? You'll see. Yes? Hi. <laughs> oh. Hello. We're looking for Mr. Madrazzo. Patricia, for fuck's sake, just let him in. Right this way, gentlemen. <laughs> Patricia, get us something to drink, would you? Quickly! Hey, good to see you again, Michael. <laughs> Likewise. It's my friend Trevor. Uh, sit down. Sit, sit, sit. So what did you tell him about me, about Martin Madrazo? Martin's an old friend of mine, Trevor. The He's truth. Said. Martin is a terrifying psychopath who tried to kill me. Exactly. Uh, uh, some people, they no longer fear me as much as they used to, people who wear clothes to me. Uh, my cousin, uh, you met in Michael. Uh. <laughs> well, apparently, he's thinking about testifying against me. So I have him killed. I'm going to. By you. Our debt was settled. This is a favor. For a friend. What does friendship mean nothing these days? Ah, uh, hello? What's the deal? This is him. Javier. He's flying off to Liberty City this afternoon. <whistles> and he's taking some files of mine. Innocent files that um, I need back. There's a gun set up in the hills. I have a man watching at the airport. We'll let you know, and when he flies by, shoot him down. And get the files back. A man, what's a pay? <laughs> huh? Trevor, come on. You still want the drink? Not now! Pendeja! Que no ves que estoy hablando con las gentes aquí? All right. You grab a vehicle, something versatile. I'll handle the gun. All right. You need anything, get me on the headset. Nearby? Not far out. Shoot the plane down and I'll be ready. There it is, out past downtown. Gotta shoot in front to compensate for the speed of the jet.
pretty. Where are you putting it down? Can you make the yellow on the airfield? Can't pull it around. We have to put it down in the field somewhere. Madrezzo and explain the human cost of this errand. Oh, take it easy, man. Listen to me. We'll talk about that later. I want you to just drop off the files. I gotta get rid of this rifle, then we'll talk. Where is he? Uh, the fuck has happened? Why did he have his car? Man, that 
piece of turd, huh? No wonder people are stabbing him in the back. What happened? Cheap bastard. You know, I really don't know why you mess around with people like that, Mikey. I mean, really, I Tell don't. Him. Answer a fucking question. I asked for a fair day's pay after a fair day's work. Then he kind of got a little angry. So I admit, I kind of got a little angry. Did you kill him? What kind of fucking animal do you take me for? No, I didn't kill him. Oh, fuck. But I did kidnap his wife. Oh, no. Oh, shit. What the fuck did you do? Oh, I just told you what I just did. Now, oh, shit. Uh, unfortunately, I think that we're going to have to lay low for a little while while, you know, we discuss things with Martin. Oh, you think? Why don't you pop in the back? All right, now, Patricia, she already called shotgun. <laughs> now, I know a nice oh, little shit. place we can hang out, you know? It's a, a very relaxing little spot. A little getaway, if you will. A cabin in the woods. You know what I'm saying. Where you at, man? Your house is empty. Oh, hey. I had to kind of lay low for a while. Yeah, that nice Mexican we met. Me and T did that job for him, and we fell out. You gotta be joking. I wish I was. So where you at now? <sighs> Desert? Out by Alamo Sea? Alright, well, I'll hit you if I find anything. Absolutely. Ah, uh, oh, hey. Trevor's got his wife. Trevor's got a wife? No, no, the Mexican's wife. What? <laughs> Shit, I don't know what to say about that one. Nothing. Nothing to say about that. Run! Run! I'm back! Come and drop her! Uh, and bring me my coffee, I'm gonna cut your arm off. Absolutely! Who the hell's that, your maid? Oh, business partner. Good guy. Very loyal. Ron, Ron, that is Michael. And this is Patricia. <laughs> ah, listen, I'm beautiful. You know, I'm sorry about everything that's happened. And, I, you know, I can't guarantee no harm's gonna come to you. I might have to chop you up into little pieces before spraying your pulp mess down the drain, but I really hope it doesn't come to that. I appreciate your honesty. You are a good man. I can see that. You need your eyes examined, then. Ron, you miss me? Yeah, Trevor, a bit, I mean. How's the fucking business? I, I, I tried. If you're gonna give me a sob story, I'm gonna rip your fucking throat out and shove a turd down the hole. It's not a sob story. It's just not quite come good yet. But I heard about something to do with Merriweather. Mm, those assholes Big again. cache of weapons they got coming in. So I thought you might want to, uh, requisition it. Fantastic! Let's go! Come in. Whoa, no, 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 not you. Sit down. You're a wanted man. Stay low. Now watch her, okay? She's a good lady. Let's go, Ron. Good to meet you, Michael. Fucking come on, let's go! Ugh. <sighs> 
The weapons are coming in by air. We've got a plane over at the airstrip. But... Great! Right, let's go! What are you going to do? We're not going to take out a private army on the ground, Ron. we got to meet them in the air. I... Uh, well... Okay, well, I knew that you were pissed after the Merryweather heist. Giving back the hardware. That was bullshit! Right. Right. So I've been monitoring chatter, tapping into Merryweather networks. Feels good to be back in the company of a professional. I gotta say, I got it. Now, I was expecting something a little more impressive. The late, great Michael Townley. Not so late and not so great, right? And no longer called Townley. The years have not been terribly kind. What's the end game, man? We had a good thing going without him. If it's such a good thing, where's my money, huh? Where's my consultant's fee and my big fat dividend? I want a franchise network, Ron. I want reward cards and merchandise. I want to make gun violence and drug dependency accessible to every man and beast. Crop duster? That's the best we can do? Get in touch with my Mexican contact! Tell him we got some guns to sell! I'll get you on the radio! Plane right ahead of me. You're gonna use those weapons for no good, King. They'll be better in our hands. Keep low. Remember, don't want to give them reason to think you're suspect. You want me to put my nose into the dirt? Oh yeah, space. Clear to gain altitude. Alrighty. Come in, light aircraft. Identify yourself and state your intent. This is Captain T in a 1989 crop duster. Just enjoying the beautiful San Andreas weather.
cargo jet to ground control. Please be advised of a change of destination. We are now landing in Mackenzie Field. Swapping radio channels. Over. Ron! Ron, you there? I got the jet. You with the buyers? Welcoming parties here, Trevor. Fly safe now. Okay! 